A band dog can kill with just one bite. This turns out to be false. A band dog has a deadly bite, but not enough to kill with just one. Even though their bite force exceeds 700 PSI and ranks second on the list of the dogs with the strongest bite. So bite force isn't the only element with which a bite is deadly. There are many other influencing factors. For example, a lion has a bite force of about 650 PSI, which is less than that of a band dog, but a lion is the one that can kill with just one bite. This is because the lion's teeth are 8 centimeters longer and also sharper. He can open his mouth twice as wide and is around 120 kilograms heavier than band dog. However, another influencing factor is probably the purpose of the bite. Since a lion bites to kill, but a band dog bites only to hurt. The origin of this dog remains unknown even today, but it's thought that its creation may have happened somewhere around the 13th century in England. In fact, Band Dog had the meaning of a strong dog that was kept chained during the day and released at night to guard the property from intruders. Actually, Band Dog is not a specific breed, but a dog that can be created by crossing an American Pit Bull Terrier or an American Bulldog with a Neapolitan Mastiff or another Mastiff. So this dog turns out to have very rich genetics, thus inheriting the strength of Mastiffs and the bad of temperament of bulldogs and American pit bull terriers. However, the band dog's bite force turns out to not be a direct inheritance of one of the dogs he has in his genetics, but some kind of combination between the bite force of mastiffs and the bite force of bulldogs. As for the bite force, a strong bite force doesn't necessarily mean a deadly one, so even a smaller bite can bring death, maybe even a tiny one. For example, mosquitoes have a bite force of around 18 micronewtons, which isn't just small, but very tiny. However, this animal brings around 800,000 deaths every year since they're a very effective spreader of diseases. The same goes for venomous snakes, scorpions, or other reptiles, which don't depend on bite force, but with it, although small, transmit the venom. However, However, even for animals that rely entirely on bite force to kill, such as lions, tigers, crocodiles, or other animals, bite force alone doesn't do the job. This depends on the weight of the animal, the shape and size of the teeth, the overall result, a result of what the bite came, and angle of the bite, and above all, the purpose of that bite. Mosquitoes, snakes, dogs, scorpions, crocodiles, elephants, and hippopotamuses are considered as the animals who kill the most humans in a year. But when it comes to deaths caused by dogs, then all of the cases are from death caused by the transmission of rabies, a disease that's 99% fatal. So far, from 900 million dogs from the whole world, around 60,000 deaths occur that don't have to do with the fatal bite, but with the transmission of a disease. In dogs, but also in animals that depend on the bite force, this is only a type of tool that must be known how to use it in order to achieve the result. This was all. Till the next video, stay cool and see ya!